Welcome back, everybody, to Subsistence. I'm an old guy, Gaming, and in this episode, we are going to go out and about and uh, continue looking for crates because until we can find more nails and other stuff we need, we can't really do a whole lot more. So let's get started with this. Is that, uh, yeah, that's an ore stone up there. Just thought I'd take a quick look on the island here. Uh, I had to, after I left you guys in the last episode, I had to log out in real life, and then uh, when I came back into the game, the bear was gone. So apparently logging out makes critters disappear. Um, I didn't do that. I didn't log out to make the bear disappear. I'm just saying that it did disappear when I logged out. So at least he's gone now, man. What a pain in the butt that dude was. Okay, so let's uh, travel across to the mainland or swim across the mainland. Uh, we absolutely got to get some nails today, so that's what we're going to do. Um, and, you know, all the other stuff we need, too, but nails are the big the big thing. Because, you know, we can get wood on the island and all that, but we can't build until we get more nails. And I also need... I don't have any... Oh, shit, I don't have any arrows either. Yeah, okay, that's another reason why we got to get some more nails. Do I have any... We got two, so, okay. Let's get to shore here first. Uh, we can we can make some uh, arrows with the two nails that we do have, and we should because we're gonna need to um, kill some more chickens and rabbits today. Rabbits actually would be pre preferable at the moment just because we you know get the cloth from them. Okay, let's see. So for arrows we need uh, sticks. We got plenty of feathers. We just need one more stick. And we need some wood for that. Okay, let's get grab some wood here real quick. Make a stick. And then we can make two arrows. And hopefully we can bag uh, two rabbits with that, preferably. Uh, but I'll take a chicken, too. I will take a chicken, too. All right. So, yeah, the name of the game today is Crates. We've got to find Crates. So let's get started here. I didn't even see that dude there. And we'll keep picking fiber, making cordage, you know, all of the usual stuff that you have to do in this game in the beginning. So I'll probably, um, probably keep you with me all, you know, for the entire episode. But starting with the next episode, I'm probably going to start doing, you know, a basic looting, you know, going out looking for crates. Uh, some of that off camera. But, you know, keep the record button ready in case something crazy happens. But in the very early game, you know, it's just, and, and I mentioned this, I think, in yesterday's episode, it's very precarious. And so from that standpoint, it it is somewhat exciting. But I know after a while it gets a little boring, too. Uh, but the thing is, is, you know, that's just how this game works and that you know you, you've got to get out and you got to loot crates and and you still have to do that even in the end game it's just a part of how the game works um and i don't mind doing it but i know it can get a little boring to watch if that's all you're doing over and over again too so we'll we'll try and come up with a happy medium for all of this we want to hit as many grub trees today as we can too so of course we can fish and that's something i can do at night time Okay. Come on, crates. Here we go. We've got an ammo crate here. Okay. Nothing that helps us right now, but not bad stuff for later. We'll work our way over to the uh, next grub tree. That, that's kind of what we'll... Uh, is that a chest there? It sure is. And a stupid level 3 wolf. Um, there's actually two chests over here, and one of them is a building chest, so let's just definitely see if we can get that one, because it's likely to have some nails in it. It's right next to that other one. Oh, look at those beautiful nails. Okay, that's 11 nails, folks. That's enough to make an, our next wall, I think. There's a bear over that way. Well. 
Um, what kind of crate is that? I think that's an ammo crate. Yeah, we got it. We got this, man. We got this. Okay. Let's check. Yeah, I mentioned this yesterday. It takes a little bit of getting used to um, with the slow run speed of this guy <laughs> in this game, man, after playing Icarus. It just seems like everything is so slow. There's a chicken. Do we want to get it or hold out for a rabbit? Well, you know what? We got some more nails. Um, Let's get it because it's... Uh, it's food here and now kind of thing, right? Even though we're not going to go back to the base for a bit. And he's still alive, too, which means he'll stay fresh longer, which is great. There's another crate there. Well, when it comes time to make ammo, right? And another one. That one wasn't so impressive. But we are getting the crates, man. Look at this. Okay, we got an apple. Let's eat that right now. Uh, I'm also going to eat the blueberries right now. And the kelp. Now to get our carbs in good shape. Our protein's okay at the moment. Alright, let's go ahead and... Get some kelp out of here. I want to make a uh, storage chest pretty quickly, too, just so we have a place to put things. Um, for those of you who don't know, when you die in this game, you lose a percentage of the stuff in your inventory. It really sucks. <laughs> oh, shit, 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 shit. Oh, Lord Almighty, that was close. Oh, no, it wasn't. We're fine. Okay. Okay. I was looking at the oxygen meter and it, I thought I was, I was, uh, that was my health meter. I forgot. We can't just go down there and stay down there indefinitely. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. I'm a little rusty. We'll get, we'll get there though. I think we're going to leave the clams alone. I know the pearls are super valuable, but we just don't have the inventory space for something like something that we don't need right now is basically what it boils down to. Uh, not counting what we pull out of crates because we get what we get, you know? Okay. Let's head over this way. There's another, uh, there's some more grub trees over here. And we got a bear and the hell is that oh a wolf yeah okay the angle that it was standing at was kind of throwing me off there for a minute I wasn't quite sure what I was looking at another wolf that way there's our next scrub tree we're going to try and get to And of course, we want to pick medicinal pants up, uh, pants. <laughs> yeah, medicinal pants, uh, plants, so we can make more biofuel. I have to keep reminding myself not to press the, uh, or that I don't have to hold the shift key down to sprint. It's a toggle. Okay, so we have another chicken. Might as well get him or her, as the case may be. Not when it goes behind a tree, though. Make sure we're not going to sidestep into a wolf or a bear or something. Alright, so that is it for those arrows. 
Um, <coughs> excuse me. Let's go ahead and butcher this chicken. And we're going to need to make some more arrows. So let's craft like maybe two more sticks and four more arrows or something. Hopefully we'll come across some more nails uh, a little bit later on today so we can make at least one more building piece. I'd like to be able to make at least, you know, one building piece a day until we... Oh, crap. Until we have an actual shelter. Uh, enclo enclosed shelter. Going. Another chicken. Where are all the rabbits at? Oh, there's a locked crate. Okay, hi, locked crate. <laughs> Can't do nothing about that for now. More blueberries. There's a grub tree up here. We'll grab that. And there's a bunny. Got it. He's still alive, too. Good. He'll stay fresh a little bit longer. Uh, crate up here. Kind of close to the bear. Let's keep an eye on Yogi there. Oh, very nice. Let's make ourselves some uh, berry water. Oh, we missed that grub tree over there, didn't we? Well, we'll see if we can hit it on the way back, because there's another one up here I'd like to snag. Okay. Let's kind of run over to that grub tree over there. Here's a crate. Come on, nails. No, nope, I'll take that stuff. It's not bad. Oh, no. Stay away from him. There's an ammo crate up here. Got some arrows. That's good. There's another chicken. Guess we'll take it. All right, we need to start thinking about getting back now because we have quite a bit of meat. And it would be a shame if it went bad right now. Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay, well, uh, unless that bear seriously buggers off here in the next little while, uh, we're not going to wait around for that grub tree. Come on, keep going that direction, homie. Eh, screw him. It's going to take too long. How many grubs do we have? Uh, we have six. Okay, that's that's enough. We can make six fishing tackle out of that. That's That's good. All right, well... Let's head on back to the base, get this meat cooked up. Chance for some more nails here. Beautiful. Look at that. 20 nails. Hot damn. Um, and we should be able to make the next part of our house. Um, I don't know if I'm going to enclose what I'm currently at at the first... Uh, or just kind of keep laying foundations down. I, I know we're a little bit cold now, but we don't really have to worry about, like, dangerously getting cold for a while because, you know, we're in April. So maybe we'll just keep kind of working on the foundations. Look at that. Two more arrows. Let's take them. Keep working on the foundations so that we can, um, you know, put together an actual house. Now... Our, our very first iteration of the base, of course, is going to be pretty small. You know, probably maybe like a 2x2, two two, I'm thinking. But we will, of course, expand it as time goes on. Uh, this probably hasn't reset, has it? Ooh, it has. Nope, it hasn't. Okay, never mind. 
All right, got a wolf over there. Let's watch out for that dude. I also have a bear up here. So let's kind of cut across this way. Here we go. Twenty nine nails. Fan friggin' tastic. We can definitely make another foundation now, and maybe a wall to go with that. Okay, we got a bear right out that way. kelp in the shallows some down there we could probably grab that one gotcha and there's some more right there too beautiful And another one. Okay, well, we're not going to have to worry about carbs tonight. Two more are right along our path. Mm, I don't think I'm going to go for that one. We could, but... I'd rather get back on shore and see if we can nab a couple more crates, if possible. And we could see if that other grub tree has reset now, too. There's a bear. Uh, is that a crate? I think it is. Yeah, I think so. It almost looks like a locked crate, though. Of course, it doesn't do us any good right now. Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> it's just a very square corner of a rock that from a distance looked like a crate. Okay, fair enough. Let's be careful. I thought I saw a wolf over here. And we, know, we definitely know there's a bear up the hill. There's some sheet metal. Let's see if we can grab this without attracting any attention. The storms uh, in the game are are uh, make things more precarious because you can't hear as well, uh, and it's easier to stumble into a an enemy that you didn't mean to. Okay, so that's it for there. Let's head back to our island, and uh, first order of business is to get this fish, or not the fish, the uh, chicken and rabbit meat and all that cooking. And then I'm going to hit the uh, the trees on the island. And then we're going to set up, we're going to build at least one more foundation. And then we'll see where we're at after that. No more, no bear visitors this time, right? Nope, looks like we're good. Okay. All right, let's put some um, wood in here. Light that sucker up. And we need to butcher. Got two things of cloth now. That's good. Why don't we drink that right now? That'll get us hydration and some fruits and veggies. We'll also eat a kelp. And another one. And maybe one more. Okay. Protein's completely out, but we've got four pieces of meat, and we have eight or six uh, grubs for fishing, so I'm not too worried about it, to be honest with you. I think we're going to be okay for the rest of today on protein. Let's just wait for these first ones to cook, because if I go off and start cutting trees now, I'm probably going to forget them, and that's not good. Not a good thing at all. 
Uh, okay, so that should be done. We'll put this one in. Let's eat these. There we go. Protein coming back. I love it. Okay, I'm going to try not to forget that, but uh, we are going to go out and cut some more wood. So yeah, the the you know the beginning of this game is is really really kind of slow because all you really can do is run around and look for crates and gather <clears throat> you know re, re, the resources that you can like the fiber and and whatnot. Um, but as we you know progress and start to get the things that we need, you know, then it'll it'll get more exciting and more cool things will happen as time goes on, especially when the hunters start getting involved. Those guys are bastards, man. So just bear with me if you guys are finding this a little bit slow pace. It's just kind of the nature of the beast at the start of this game. All right, let's go back and get that other piece of meat. Yay, meat. I remembered it. Look at me. Okay, and we're going to just eat it right out of the fire. Excellent. Okay, let's go get this other, uh, these other couple of trees here, and then we're gonna make another foundation, and then we'll see if we, what else we might be able to make um, in terms of our structure. These are all small trees, so only get three wood each, but at least they're handy, right? They're just right here for us, and so not too hard to to get to. If any of you are watching me for the first time and watching Subsistence for the first time, or even if you're not, um, I do have a season one and we recorded 66 episodes and just had a blast with the game. And we did have some crazy stuff happen in season one too. Um, so that is also on the channel if you're interested in watching. And I started, I started season one blind. I'd never played the game before. Never really even watched anybody else play it. So, yeah, it was an interesting learning curve. But, you know, now we are veterans of the game. That doesn't mean I know everything there is to know about it or will, you know, do everything right all the time. <laughs> like, you guys are like going, yeah, why would you even think that? Um, but, I mean, you know, we, we definitely know a lot more about what we're doing this time around than we did the first time around. So... All right, so let's see here. We can... Uh, we're going to have to make boards. And I also want to make sure we have another fire starter. We always want to have a fire starter in here. I'm just... You know, it's too much of a hassle to me to make... Um, what am I trying to say? To try and keep the fire, the campfire running because it just consumes fuel too quickly. Um, but, you know, we really should keep it going and do some fishing before we... Well, no, here, let's do this. Uh, I need to make a stick, so let's make a stick. We'll get the fire starter going. And then uh, we need to get some tackle going. But let's make our building piece first. Um, okay, so let's get that crafting. Uh, now, I think I want to make another foundation. So we're going to need five boards for that. So let's make five boards. The wood goes fast. <laughs> it really does. Yeah. It really does. And then we'll lay another foundation down. And like I said, I think we're going to start with a 2 by 2 And then we will expand it, you know, as time goes on. But a 2 by 2 will give us enough room to put down, you know, some of the really early game uh, stations and stuff that we need. And, um, you know, allow us to still move around and that sort of thing. Uh, we also, well, let's see, hold on a sec. I'm looking for, where do we make the bed? Oh, you know what? I bet we have to make that with the BCU. Couldn't we, can't we make like a sleeping bag in this game or not? I must be thinking of a different game. It wouldn't be a bad idea for us to do some animal traps either. 
we could just set those down and then um you know go out and about and come back and have some animals yeah i'm not seeing a sleeping bag so i guess we don't make that one i know we do make a bed but we, i'm sure we have to have the bcu for that let's go back to here and make ourselves another foundation so that takes 12 nails to make that sucker so that leaves us five, uh, five nails left uh, 10 nails to make one of those and to make one of those so I think I'm gonna turn the other five nails just into arrows well how many nails does this require that requires seven nails oh wait no okay hold on I was misreading that okay here let's put uh, let's get this guy in place here. Okay, cool. Now we can't get up on our platform. <laughs> Seriously? Yeah, we can get up over here. Okay. There we go. All right. So, actually, no. I yeah, I was thinking it was hadn't taken nails. We still have 17 more nails. That means we could make we can actually make another platform or foundation. Um, but I think actually what I want to do is make a make a storage chest so we're not carrying all this stuff around with us all the time. If we because if we die, we're gonna lose some of it. So let's make a storage chest next, and we're just gonna plop it down right here next to the fire. So yeah, well, <coughs> I think we're doing you know reasonably well. All things considered. Um, let's see. Let's go back to here for a second. I just... All right, we made cordage. Okay, so we need to make four more boards. Ah, shoot. We're, <laughs> we're sh shy. Just a little bit of wood. Damn it. Damn it, Jim. Can we... Uh... We can't do anything with that campfire. I made another one. I didn't really need to, but... I did. So all of these, yeah, these are all harvested, right? I, did we hit all of them? We just need, like, two more pieces of wood. I'm pretty sure I did, though. Eh. Okay. Well, you know what? I can't complain. I think we had a, a reasonably good day today. So what I'm going to do, guys, is... in the, uh, I'm going to make some fishing tackle. Well, I don't even know if I can do that without more wood. So we might have to wait a little bit longer even. Uh, but what I'm going to do is make some fishing tackle, you know, fish and, you know, get some more protein. And then uh, set out tomorrow morning. Ooh, we got a storm coming in. I'm glad we got a, a roof over our head. I set out tomorrow morning and, um, you know, keep doing the looting. But again, I don't think I'm going to... I'm not going to sh show keep showing all of it on camera like we did for the first three episodes. Uh, so I'll probably maybe start with uh, start doing some you know gathering and looting before I start the episode. Um, but I will always, like I said, I'll always keep the record button ready to go in case something exciting happens. Uh, in, you know, in the in in the interim. So, well, with that said, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment to share out the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye bye.